I do. I trusted you. I'm the Flying Dutchman. So you've got my old flying dinghy over the side and all your friends onto it. But at least you won't get away from me. You'll be my cabin boy from now until the seas dry up. Give it up, Dutchman. Your haunting nights are numbered. I'll wipe the deck with you, Sponge. Psst. Hello? I do not recommend that you antagonize him right now. Ah, oh, who's afraid of the big bad Dutchman? You don't understand. The book you borrowed from Squidward was not completely accurate. In fact, it was a little out of date. Uh-oh. According to the new edition, the treasures you gathered have made you mostly immune to the Dutchman's powers. But not completely immune. So be ready for a tough fight. Uh, <laughs> I'm not ready. I'm not ready. You don't stand a chance, Squarepants. I'm the Flying Dutchman! SpongeBob? I don't know, Patrick. What do you think, Mr. Krabs? To the Krusty Krab, everyone! For a feast like no other! Oh, Mr. Krabs, I'm so happy! Yee haw! That's what I call a celebration! Yay! Yee haw! Woo hoo hoo! Of course, uh, you know this is coming out of your paychecks. That guy, with that big square head and those short shorts, that's the most hideous thing I've ever seen! Wait, that hideous thing looks like me! I always knew Spongebob would be the death of me! Jump in, jelly beans! A robot Spongebob! There's definitely something funny going on here. And I don't mean you. Something else funny. Oh! Plankton! You're behind all this, aren't you? Yes, yes, it was me all the time. Behold, the Duplicatotron. I registered the name, so don't even think you're ripping me off. With this, I can make a robot copy of anyone. I was going to make an army of loyal robots that would obey my every command. But they're running amok! I, uh, I forgot to set the switch to obey Plankton. Ugh. But now that Daddy's home, I can fix that! What's wrong now? It should be working! It is working! They're obeying me! I knew I shouldn't have made a copy of myself, but I'm just so cute! You've interfered with my plans for the last time! SpongeBob, meet SpongeBob! Hi, how do you do? Allow me to introduce my friends, Patrick, Sandy... Enough! Prepare to meet your doom! And here we are, folks, the main event! A gauntlet of literary ferocity! Look at that! The robot made himself dizzy! The robot better change tactics and fast! And the robot is down! The robot better change tactics and fast!
you're supposed to get married next week. Did he say married? I'll repair you, baby. Oh, I'm shrinking! No, Badrick. I think the robot is getting bigger! SpongeBob, he just flew into your head! Well, then I'm going to follow him into my head. I mean, into my robot version's head. Which is like my head, but bigger and more metallic. Will you go already? Here I come, robot plankton! This is just getting too weird for me. to neutralize the giant robot's brain? Or will SpongeBob go home defeated and dejected? Stay tuned! SpongeBob, hit the fuse! SpongeBob, the to go, the launch to go. I'm becoming a lawyer. You haven't defeated me yet. I still have lots of robots all over Bikini Bottom. I'll summon them all, and then we'll see. Uh-oh. I'll destroy you. You'll destroy me. I'll destroy you. I'll destroy you 
you twice as hard. Oh yeah, I'll destroy you plus one. Well, I'll destroy you plus infinity. Shut up, you stupid robot. Who are you calling stupid? I went to community college, you oversized coffee grinder. Oh yeah, I'll show you. Well, Plankton, I hope you learned your lesson. Oh, I certainly did. Next time, I'll get it right. <laughs> Ouch! We won! Who wants to get ice cream? I do! I do! Need I remind you all that there are still robots out there making a mess of Bikini Bottom? Sandy is right. I thought she was a squirrel. I'm being punished. I don't know for what, but I'm being punished. There's still work to be done out there. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy wouldn't stop, and neither will I. We can't rest until Bikini Bottom is safe. I brought back King Neptune's crown, and I'm here to save Mr. Krabs. Nice work, SpongeBob. You made it all the way to Shell City and back. That's a heroic feat. Too bad it won't help. All hail, Plankton. Hey, King Neptune already has a crown. That's no crown, Patrick. It's one of Plankton's bucket hats. Plankton is controlling King Neptune. That's right. And now I'll have the pleasure of removing you along with your friends. Neptune, I command you to kill SpongeBob. Kill SpongeBob. All hail, Plankton. Dodge, SpongeBob, dodge!
up, you idiot! Idiot? Uh, no, no. Uh, idiot. <laughs> uh, French for a uh, handsome man. <coughs> Eugene Krabs, it looks like you were innocent the whole time. Oh well, that's why pencils have erasers. And now to thank the brave heroes who recovered my crown and saved Bikini Bottom. SpongeBob and Patrick, you have performed a manly deed. I'm so proud of you. Thanks, Mindy. I've learned a few things about myself. I may be a dork and a wingnut. A knucklehead and expasitron. Yes, but more importantly, I'm a kid, and I like being a kid. I'm just glad that everything is back to normal. And so ends the most heroic tale ever told in Bikini Bottom. And as the sun sets over the island paradise above the waves, we must stop and wonder how long until the sequel depends on the box office. Now go outside and get some sun. You look awful pale. situation is escalating enormously, and our heroes are forced to change their plan. They head into a construction yard to face giant plankton and the sheer unimaginable horror of the extended coffee break. SpongeBob versus Plankton in a pitched battle here in Bikini Bottom. Will our heroes bring Plankton crashing to the ground, or will they just annoy him a bit? It's going to be the second one, isn't it? Think your puny plane can dislodge me? Okay, Plankin, you're stomping around and climbing up things in now! Go 
You'll never knock me down! My perch is as stable as my mind! That's it! Just one more to go, and Bikini Bottom is safe! Whoa! Whoa! Ouch! My flagella! Are you okay, Plankton? I think I've suffered mild abrasions! And maybe some light grazing! Oh, poor giant microscopic organism! Let me give you a hand! Oh no! Allow me! Yeah! Uh, how can I sleep in a time like this? Well, it must be a panic reflex, I guess. Yep, panic. Panic? Panic! I'm panicking! I'm panicking! Panic button! Wow, why did he come big? And, and he's got SpongeBob! Oh no! Uh, 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 what am I gonna do? Uh, uh, think, think, think! Nope, no thoughts today. Mermaid Man! What's all the noise? I'm trying to nap! I'm Starfish Man! Can we team up? Can we? That's right, Ray. I'm here in downtown Bikini Bottom, covering events live as they happen. <laughs> All of Bikini Bottom will bow before me! We seem to have a major situation developing right here on the rooftops. It's giant plankton versus what appears to be a chubby pink starfish in his underpants. Give up, starfish man! The plankton army is unstoppable! Leave him alone, plankton! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Time to go bye-bye! And it looks like the plankton is about to start throwing cars at his five-pointed adversary. But first, here's the weather. Let's see you dodge this! Hope you've got a hard head, Starfish Man! You are no match for my atomic poweredness! Who ever heard of a Starfish superhero? He's just trying to scare you! No mess with Starfish, forget it! I'm smaller and bigger than you! Hang in there, Starfish man! Stay back a jump! Hook marks and see me now! Watch out below! Starfish should be flat! Car crash imminent! Must I always have to do everything myself? That's good. You thought one of me was tough. Well, what about a whole army of plankton? Things aren't looking too good for our hero. Power of the starfish. Right, that's it. Big attack time. I'm gonna flatten you, Pinky. What goes up must come down! Ouch! A cursed lack of depth perception, time for plan B!
Bay's roof-to-roof -roof battle is heating up. The starfish is bravely battling on, but the plankton is getting closer. And we'll be back after these messages. I'm a Bye-bye, Daddy. It's... Fear me! Prepare to be blasted, starfish man! Curse you, starfish man! Woo! starfish man! Oh boy, you asked for it! tonight's live edition of World's Greatest Rooftop Encounter. Tonight on the show, When Plankton Go Big. Come on, Starfish Man. 
You need the power of the sponge! Sting like a jumpfish! No mess with Starfish Man! Prepare to be blasted, Starfish Man! Ground slam on the buttons to control the brain, Starfish Man! Starfish Man, he is looking awesome down there! Go me! Spongebob, you see me now! And don't do it again! Prepare to be blasted, Starfish Man! This is all too much excitement for me! This is an unfortunate predicament. Luckily, my grip is firm and true. Maybe I should give you a helping hand! and control the brains! Look at him go! Now you're seeing stars! And don't do it again! Oh, you think you're so clever! Well, take this! Use the buttons and control the cranes! There was something I was supposed to be doing. Oh, yes, I remember. This news just in. The plucky starfish is making his final stand against the colossal might of the... Do you mind? We're trying to have a titanic battle here! Sorry, we'll try and keep it down. I'm glad you finally got here, starfish man. Now this is the shrinkifier ray. Trouble is, it keeps disappearing down these hatches. It's mighty annoying. When you do catch up with it, just charge it up and fire! Hope that helps. I gotta go. It's my dinner time. They're serving me both! You can do it, Starfish Man! Starfish Man, try on! Did you see? I did it was protected! Go B! Go B! Yeah, yeah, yeah! Yeah, you see it's going! Yeah, yeah! You can do it, Starfish Man! Okay, now I'm worried. Go me! Stays like a jump! 
How about the Sturfish? You can do it, Starfish Man! Things aren't looking as peachy as I thought. Spongebob's in same Did I win? Yay! Thank you for trying, Patrick, old pal. But it looks like we've made it to Shangri-La. Not Shangri-La, my peripherous friend, but a manifestation of your nocturnal subconsciousness.
This talking speck will make an excellent replacement for our recently deflated national treasure. So long, and thanks for the tour. Close of this quickly. Oh. Of course, now I remember. I put the formula in the safe. After all, Mr. Krabs told me to put it somewhere safe. Ah. Boy, I love it when things work out. <laughs> Sponge fool! Little did you realize that while desperately trying to keep me away from the formula, you've only succeeded in leading me directly to it! And now that I know its precious location, your beloved Krusty Krab is doomed! <laughs> and all before lunchtime. What? Ah, my brilliant plan has struck you speechless, I see. I think the words you're searching for are, Plankton, you're a genius. Well, SpongeBob, you and your holes will have to excuse me. There's a secret formula out there with my name on it. Mr. Krabs is the only name on that formula. Not when I get through with it. Watch your fingers! Oh, goody! Oh, and I've come so far! I won't let Mr. Krabs down now! Thank you. 
You flipping patties for the big celebration. Time is money. It was so horrible, Mr. Krabs. I was trapped inside Plankton's evil machine, and there was no bathroom in there. What are you talking about, that? Well, Mr. Krabs, a funny story. I thought I lost the secret formula. Lost the secret formula? I told you to put it in the safe. This is a mutiny. Don't worry, Mr. Krabs. I said I thought I lost the secret formula, but I didn't. I did put it in the safe! But I, I put it... I was 100% sure I... Oh, Mr. Krabs! I feel dizzy! I can't breathe! I can't feel my legs! Oh, wait! Here it is! Ah, it was in my back pocket the whole time! Hey, that's me lottery ticket! Oops! I guess I never gave you the formula after all. <laughs> ah, here it is. It was in my back pocket the whole time. <laughs> Your back pocket of all the love. Ten years of frustration. Ten long years of chasing after that formula. I almost had it that time, too. Oh, the anguish, the humiliation. <laughs> well, I'll try again tomorrow. SpongeBob, my boy! Well done, well done! I did it! I did it! I'm a winner! I did it! Oh, this is the best day ever! Right you are! You come on over here, and let's get you that license to drive! Stand just like that, very good! Now hold still. Friends, <clears throat> may I have your attention? <clears throat> It is my great honor to present SpongeBob SquarePants, fair citizen of Bikini Bottom, with his very own license to drive. I would like to thank all of the little people who made this day possible. To Mr. Krabs, I thank you for allowing me to work triple overtime to pay you for the chance to take these lessons. And Patrick, Patrick, my dear friend, and of course, Mrs. Puff. Where would I be without... Oh, Mrs. Puff, I'm so excited to see you! SpongeBob, how exciting! <laughs> May I see your license? Here you go, Mrs. Puff. I present my license. Just as I suspected. My eyes are blue? No, what I meant was... But they are blue, see? Yes, SpongeBob, but what I meant was... And pretty. Blink, blink. Yes, very pretty. But this license... It's beautiful, isn't it? Beautiful. <laughs> yes. But I'm afraid it's not real. Ha <laughs> ha! You're quite the kidder, Mrs. Puff. <laughs> I'm afraid you've been had, SpongeBob. <laughs> I trusted you! You can't catch me! So long, sucker!
welcome here anymore, Seymour. After all that, it was just a scam. Evil. Evil. I would have pulled it off too if it wasn't for Mrs. Puffs meddling around. I guess I'm not going to get my license after all. That's okay, SpongeBob. You can always take classes from Mrs. Puff again next year. Yeah, you're right. Oh, Mrs. Puff, how can I ever thank you? <laughs> no need to thank me, SpongeBob. <laughs> <laughs> oh, what have I done? Hey, Clinton, what are you doing? Don't bother me now, kid. The third key to the safe is around here somewhere, and I intend to find it. You'll never find it, Plankton, because I'm the one who hit it. And even I don't remember where I put it. Well, the map says it's around here somewhere. That or it's a blasted sesame seed. I tell you, this map is confusion! Once you pesky meddlers are out of the way, I will find that key and claim my rightful place as ruler of all Bikini Bottom! Not so fast, Plankton. You have forgotten one crucial detail. Oh yeah? What's that, numbskull? Yeah, Patrick, what is it? What's what? The crucial detail? Oh, why forget?
<laughs> Defeated again? <clears throat> Why is it that even with my superior intellect, powerful technology, and dashing good looks, I cannot realize my dream of fast food supremacy? Perhaps it's because you are a puny, annoying pest? That's one reason. Enjoy this moment all you want, Krabs. It doesn't matter anyway. Someday soon, I will find that final key, and then victory will be mine! Does it matter? Matter? Matt? Hold that thought. There you are, me little beauty. Now, I'll we'll just open that safe, and the Krabby Patty formula will be back in its rightful hands. The formula is in your pocket. My pocket? Hmm. Oh, and so it is. I had it with me all along. Davy Jones's ghost, I'm clever. You mean we did all that for nothing? Well, not for nothing, Squidward. I think we all learned a valuable lesson. Oh, and what was that, SpongeBob? We learned that before you fight a giant robot army, always remember to look in Mr. Krabs' pocket. Words to live by. I sure am glad things are back to normal here in Bikini Bottom. Say, I wonder whatever happened to those batteries anyway. Oh, uh, what batteries? Oh, never mind. By the way, Patrick, the reception on your television sure is incredible. Well, thank you very much. More pickles. Two gherkins, please. SpongeBob, if you lived inside your own brain, where would you be? If I were me, I think I'd be this way. SpongeBob, you've got to wake up. And for once, I mean that literally. Okay, Squidward, but we've got to get to me first. Ah ha! All we have to do is use the switches to create a path to you, um, him, and fend off all these weird creatures. Jeez, why don't you give us something hard to do? It's true. The clarinet is really, really, really hard to play underwater. Time to end this fiasco. Please don't hurt me, adorable candy heart. Super stuff! But hurry, it wears off quickly. Super charge! Gum machine, run! Doing the chewing!
Luigi, eh? Looks to me like you've got a glass jaw. Please don't hurt me, adorable candy heart. What the fuck, Stop thinking about candy already! Bob, why is your brain making me so hungry? My super energy is full! Now I can do super stuff! But hurry, it wears off quickly. I feel like I could explode! I really want to say to you right now, Mr. Me, is uh, please wake up! Huh? Oh, 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 ah! oh, we did it! Oh, what a team! Bubbles! Well done, heroes. You found the last page. Where was it? Turns out it was in my head the whole time. My poorest friend, your mind is a crazy place. I'd better take all these pages into another dimension for safekeeping. Hmm, a little light. There are still some stray pages out there. Perhaps this will help. Patrons, time machine! Go back to any point in time to find those last pages. Happy hunting, friends. What stray pages? I'm pretty sure we got them all. Never mind! Well done, heroes. You found the last page. Where was it? Turns out it was in my head the whole time. My poorest friend, your mind is a crazy place. I'd better take all these pages into another dimension for safekeeping. You collected every last page. For that, I think you deserve a little something extra. Patience! With this, you can relive any part of this amazing day. Oh, oh, yeah. Yeah. Thanks, Bubbles. But that's not all. Oh, uh, would you look at the it's time? Late. I better get going. We'll watch you break dance till the end of time, Bubbles. Yeah. And by the way, when is that? This is getting kind of boring. Interdimensional dance party. <laughs> Look at that guy, with that big square head and those short shorts. That's the most hideous thing I've ever seen. Wait, that hideous thing looks like me. I always knew SpongeBob would be the death of me. Chug bin, jelly beans, a robot SpongeBob. There's definitely something funny going on here. And I don't mean you, something else funny. Oh, <gasps> Plankton, you're behind all this, aren't you? Yes, yes, it was me all the time! Behold, the Duplicato Drug! I registered the name, so don't even think you're ripping me off. 
With this, I can make a robot copy of anyone. I was going to make an army of loyal robots that would obey my every command. But they're running amok! I, uh, I forgot to set the switch to obey Plankton. Ugh. But now that Daddy's home, I can fix that! What's wrong now? It should be working! It is working! They're obeying me! I knew I shouldn't have made a copy of myself, but I'm just so cute! You've interfered with my plans for the last time! SpongeBob, meet SpongeBob! Hi, how do you do? Allow me to introduce my friends, Patrick, Sandy... Enough! Prepare to meet your doom!
smell of bubbles in the morning. Smells like victory. I'm becoming a lawyer. You haven't defeated me yet. I still have lots of robots all over Bikini Bottom. I'll summon them all, and then we'll see. Uh-oh. I'll destroy you. You'll destroy me. I'll destroy you. I'll destroy you twice as hard. Oh, yeah? I'll destroy you plus one. Well, I'll destroy you plus infinity. Shut up, you stupid robot! Who are you calling stupid? I went to community college, you oversized puppy grinder! Oh yeah? I'll show you! Come here and fight like a monster. Well, Plankton, I hope you learned your lesson. Oh, I certainly did! Next time I'll get it right! <laughs> Ouch! We won! Who wants to get ice cream? I do! I do! Need I remind you all that there are still robots out there making a mess of Bikini Bottom? Sandy is right. Well, I thought she was a squirrel. I'm being punished. I don't know for what, but I'm being punished. There's still work to be done out there. Mermaid Man and Barnacle Boy wouldn't stop, and neither will I. We can't rest until Bikini Bottom is safe. Squarepants, this time you took things too far. Well, well, well. His royal hiney finally decided to show up. This snail oil saleswoman broke into my royal bath time chamber and stole my bubble soap. She never posed any real danger until your can-do attitude enabled her. Do you have any idea how much power she'll wield once she has enough jelly? I am now the queen of the ocean, and with the power of the cosmic jelly, I will reshape the seas according to my wishes! <laughs> SpongeBob, I have tolerated your annoying little slip-ups for years now, but I have had it! Because of you, I have been kidnapped, I had to relearn to speak, and my toilet is clogged with jelly! Enough is enough! 
you know what? It's not that bad. I'll just get the plunger. You're going nowhere, my delicious little rage muffin. You have the perfect attitude to be my new pet. <laughs> My wishes may have shaken up the world, but Cassandra's the one who's gone out of control. It's time to stop it for good and save our friends once and for all. And look really cool while we do it. today. Word. I'm so glad you're back to normal. Yeah, what happened? And why does my mouth taste like jelly? I have to hand it to you, SpongeBob. Your quirky approach did what the Royal Guard failed to do. You apprehended Madame Cassandra. Of course, you also empowered her to nearly destroy us all. But that's jelly under the bridge now. <laughs> As a reward for your outstanding bravery, I shall grant you one final wish, so make it count. After today, there's only one thing I could wish for, and that is... That was fun! I wish we could do it all over again! Patrick, no! 